Hey, what's up, you guys? It's me, Dati, and I'm back with another video. Today's video is going to be um, a chat with me because there are some important things that I want to talk to you about and I think you guys should be aware about. So, let's just get straight into it. Okay, so, let's just squash this rumor, okay? There's a rumor going around and it's a, it's affecting me quite a lot there's a rumor going around saying that One Direction is gonna break up so everybody likes to think that because they went on this you know break this hiatus that um they're not gonna want to come back and be a band but I would like to disagree. The boys themselves said that they're going to come back, that they feel like they, you know, they still don't feel like they've accomplished things, so they're going to come back. And yeah, I don't I don't understand why people keep saying that they're going to break up, that they're going to break up. The day that all the boys plus their twit their um t their group a uh, joint account say that they are breaking up that they are dismembering that they will no longer be one direction then i will be making a video talking about oh they broke up but for people to just speculate and sit there and be like Oh, did you hear about One Direction? They're breaking up. No, no, sweetheart. They're not. They're not breaking up because they're going to come back. They are going to keep making music. They're going to go on tour. So, like, why do you keep saying that? Like, whatever. So, I just wanted to get that out of the way because, you know, there's a lot of people talking about how they're going to um, break up and, like, no, that bothers me because they're, like, one of my favorite you know, they're one of my favorite bands. So, okay, since we got that out of the way, since we're talking about One Direction, let's just talk about Harry and freaking Kendall Jenner, okay? Harry and Kendall Jenner were um, photographed on a yacht in St. Saint Bart's where a couple of celebrities were all, you know, celebrating the new year. And they were photographed cuddling and maybe kissing. Uh, having just a jolly good time with each other. Um, Chloe, Kendall's sister, is saying that they're dating I want to see the receipts I want to see pictures of Harry and Kendall going out to dinner I want to see them holding hands because if I don't see that proof it's actually not happening it hasn't happened yet it doesn't exist so people saying oh Khloe Kardashian said that they're going out no 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 until I start seeing Harry posting pictures of Kendall on his Instagram, Kendall posting pictures of Harry on her Instagram, pictures of them surfacing, going out to dinner a lot, then we'll talk. But until then, it's non-existent. It's not existent in my world until I see actual and literal proof. Okay? Thanks. And since we're talking about people going out, Gigi Hadid and Zayn, what? Like, can you put two of the most, like, like, what? Okay, so Gigi, we all know Gigi, hello, she's a freaking goddess, she's fucking hot, and then you have Zayn. 
was also hot. Like, you, you can't just put two hot people together in a relationship and, like, not expect the world to explode. You know what I'm saying? So, you know, I'm pretty sure this is what the world felt like when they found out that Angelina Jolie and Brad Pitt were getting together. Because, or, like, Jay-Z and Beyonce getting together. Because, like what like I feel like these two people are just really great hot individuals that deserve each other because they're hot um yeah that's really all I have to say about it honestly there's two different types of people in this world there's people in this situation who are like Oh, well, you know, let them be happy. They're awesome for each other. And then there's people who are like, no, you can't date Zayn because Zayn can never be dated by anyone because he's Zayn, you know, because you have so much love for him. And that's how I felt at the beginning. And I was just like, nah, 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 nah. Nah, she's going to need to back up and, like, get her life together. But then I watched the Victoria's Secret fashion show and I was like, yeah, he, 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 um, yeah, she, 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 she could go out with him, you know, whatever. Um, but like, I don't understand, like, I don't get myself because like, I'm perfectly okay with Zayn dating Gigi, but like, I have a problem with Harry dating Kendall, which I don't have like any beef with Kendall, you know, cause you know, like, why would I? not like her you know what I mean um I feel like you know Kendall out of her whole family has like her head screwed on right on her shoulders you know she's very private she's very smart she does her work she's, she does what she's got to do and you know you know whatever <coughs> I don't know. I don't know why I feel some type of way towards that relationship and I don't for Gigi and Zayn. I don't know. I'm a very confusing person. It is what it is. I don't know. Since we're talking about Zayn, we can just talk about his interview that he did with Billboard magazine. Like, those pictures killed me killed me I'm currently right now like I'm in a grave you know tombstone and everything you know you could come drop flowers off to me but like I I am currently I I edited this video from my grave okay they have Wi-Fi underground all right so you know but I'm just gonna like flash pictures of you know the of this interview on the screen. I know, I know. How can one guy be that good looking? I don't know. But that wraps up today's video. Um, I hope you like it. If you did, please give it a big old thumbs up. If you have any ideas of what you want to see me record, please leave them down below. If there's anything else you want me to talk about, also leave them down below. Um, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye.